Gina Palace here with Home Bunnies. Today I'm going to show you how to do a crunch while on your hands and knees. The thing about crunches is they can be nice for isolating out our abs, but they're not the most functional position because most of our abdominal work is going to be taking place while we're standing up or bending over to do something. So when we're in hands and knees, we're actually going to get that replication of how the core is working in that type of environment. <clears throat> so if I'm here and I want to do my crunch, which would normally be using these muscles, what I'm going to do is let my belly go. Just letting it all hang out completely relaxed. You'll see that that affects my spine as well. Now I'm going to use my belly muscles to pull up, which then hopefully flattens my spine a bit so that there's no longer a valley across my lower back. Letting it all hang out again, taking the time to be sure you're fully relaxed, and then pulling it up. So as you can see, this is basically taking my abs and shortening them from rib cage down to pubic bone so that I'm able to get those muscles pulling together, but I'm also using gravity as an assist to make them fight against that. The cool thing about this too is it's going to teach you a better spine control so that your spine is in a better position while you go about your daily tasks.